boys we have a new street racing game it is developed by just one dude now unfortunately we can't use our direct drive steering wheel because uh, it's a brand new game just came out but by the way it is free it's a completely free game uh, so i'm gonna be trying to use my controller hopefully that works wait controller actually works okay that's pretty good so we don't have to use our keyboard okay we have different car oh bro this skyline okay i want to try the skyline i know you guys love the super as well i want i want the skyline i want to see the skyline uh let's see change the gear button okay automatic nah we're, we're not listen we're not gonna use automatic uh let's go and do a test start i think we just gotta click over here i'm not really good at controller but let's see okay we're going this is the start okay we're, we're maybe oh bro the movement is sick okay i feel like we're dropping a little bit of frames so the game is maybe not the best optimized. Oh, the brake lights, bro. The brake lights look sick. Oh, baby, bro. Look at that. Oh, that's nice. That's, guys, this looks like a set of Corsa. Let's look at this city, guys. The graphics. Now, guys, am I tripping? Or I feel like I'm playing like a set of Corsa on some kind of a custom Shitoku server. Like, dude, it, this is all done by one developer. Uh, physics looking really good. I feel like I'm playing a set of Corsa. Like, <laughs> I'm surprised. I thought this was gonna be more horrible. Okay, the sparks. I, I don't know about the sparks. Maybe the sparks need some work. Dude, imagine this game with online support and like steering wheel support. Okay, the developer. Uh, listen, if you add the wheel support and online support, then we might finally have competition for these uh, these Assetto Corsa Shitoku servers. I'm not capping when I say Assetto Corsa. These Shotoku maps, they don't look better than that. I feel like they look similar. Like, maybe this dude even ripped off the Shotoku map from a set of Corsa. I don't know. I don't believe that. But if he did, maybe that's why it looks so similar. But don't take my word for it. Okay, I have no idea. The game is good in terms of graphics. One thing that I love more about this game than a set of Corsa is when you hit the barriers, the car doesn't go bananas. Like, in a set of Corsa, there's like a weird thing where you hit the barriers and the physics go nuts and you see like very weird crashes like you can like feel the barrier and the car doesn't go nuts like check it out it just like straightens out like somehow i like this more uh, right now i'm trying to do and uh, trying to drive as fast as i can so i will change my car and compare the total time with this r34 to see if i have evolved or not okay i keep forgetting to change gears as well okay something that is different over here that i've never seen in other games yeah guys i'm not tripping uh if you guys look at the bottom corner bottom right corner this is current horsepower at the rear wheels or all wheels i guess in this case this is all we drive we're gonna break the four corners yep that was pretty good but yeah the fact that you can see horsepower like live horsepower that the car is using i feel like that is a unique aspect like i don't I don't think any other game shows you that. It's an object over here. Okay, I can see a corner. Oh, never mind. Finish. Uh, wow, I'm just I'm surprised. Three things I want from this game. No, four things. Better optimization, AI traffic, multiplayer support, and steering wheel support. Okay, four things. Developer. Uh, so let's try to change the uh, the vehicle. Gonna try to use automatic as well. Maybe that makes me faster. So this is gonna be a different car with automatic. So I don't have to focus on the gears at the moment. I keep forgetting getting to change the gears anyway so uh let's go over here we're gonna go the other way maybe okay we're going boys this is a new vehicle this is a build side rx7 and oh yeah okay oh whoa, 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 whoa. this is really snappy boy oh yeah bro automatic is way better for me <laughs> if, if i had a wheel i would prefer manual but on controller maybe maybe automatic is better bro look at that okay now i'm zooming now i'm actually zooming i can focus on the corners i can look at the mini map as well right now we only have this one loop you can go one way or the other way and we have three vehicles i mean we gotta try out the supra as well fun fact the r34 did have more horsepower definitely had more horsepower than the rx7 and uh, the buildings everything it's just i have no no issues with the graphics in terms of optimization i feel like i shouldn't be dropping frames although i am getting a new pc soon because i can't even run beam and g multiplayer with max graphics maybe i can give this game a second chance as well and that was a drift that was our first drift in this game. Jeez. Okay. Woo. Okay, yeah, guys, I'm not used to controller. I'm, like, using it like a keyboard. Like, full left to full right in course. Okay, we got a break over here. Oh, that was a that was a drift again. Oh, guess. Oh, wow. Oh, pfft. 
Okay, all right. Is it very grippy? I feel the grip. What I like is you don't instantly spin out when you like go into a drift. In some games, when you lose control, you you're done. I would pay money. Developer, I'm not joking. I would pay money that you add wheel support. I don't know how easy it is to do. Probably if you. Oh goodness. Uh, well, we did crash. We can change the camera. Look at that. We can change the camera, bro. By the way, this is really good. Although I wish we could have the hood view. Like I want to see the hood as well when I'm in this view, but. This is also fine, bro. Between traffic, imagine this view with traffic cars. Oh, baby, I like it. Another checkpoint over here. Oh, this is the finish. Okay. Uh, I mean, we do have one car to check. The, the Supra. I, I want to know. I've tested two cars. Okay. There is a horsepower difference for sure. Uh, I think the R34 was even a little bit easier to handle. Uh, so we're going to try out this Supra as well. And see if the cars handle differently as well. Change the car. Okay, now I am using the Supra, boys. Let's see what the Supra looks like. Okay, we're going. Uh, okay, Supra. Feels like it's very wiggly. I feel like R34 was like planted. Okay, the turning radius on Supra is horrible. I feel like maybe the Supra is the worst car to drive over here. RX7 definitely, I feel like, had a better turning radius. Woo! Bro, the Supra feels so heavy, bro. Supra feels so heavy. I gotta check the numbers. Is Supra actually heavier than the RX-7? We do have all the legit cars with the proper logos. Uh, so I don't know how long this game is gonna last with the proper named cars and the logos. Do you even know how much? If I made a game and I wanted like, let's say Mazda logos, how much would that cost? Does anyone know? I would really want to know that. Oh, look at this. That was a kind of a drift. Oh, this. Wow. Oh, good. We saw a flame over there. Uh, let's break and turn. Okay, the sparks need work. Maybe like remove the sparks all together or make them look better. Right now, the sparks look a little cheap. I don't know. That is the only thing that looks cheap. Everything else looks beautiful. And we finished the run with Supra as well. Now, I do want to know. Wait, that was our new record. Supra is the fastest car. Confirmed. Oh, max speed new record probably. Okay, so I want to know, is there a difference with weight as well? Weight, 1.5, 1.5. Oh, that's what I felt, bro. When I started using the Supra, I felt it was heavier than the RX-7. Bro, I felt it. I knew it. Supra, actually, I feel like he's the fastest car because it has the best power to weight ratio. So that's why I got the best time or top speed with the Supra, I feel like. Okay, so that is the game. Uh, guys, it is free. I'm gonna link the video of the original creator in the description so you guys can go over there. There will be a download link in his video description. I see there being a lot of potential. I honestly thought this was gonna be way worse. Single developer on Unity. Uh, I'm pleasantly surprised. So boys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like, make sure you subscribe because I will be testing out all the new games, all the new upcoming games, okay? And as always, stay sideways. Peace!